Hello and welcome to Forger Product Essentials Library Preview. My name is Matthias, I'm the Principal Instructor of Fortrock and I had the pleasure to create a few videos about Fortrock software. Before we go into an overview here, I'd like to give you a short introduction to the Fortrock Identity Platform. We like identities, identities for workforce, which is basically employees, consumers or customers or things. Those different types of identities all have different requirements for authentication and authorization and maybe federation and therefore we distinguish between the three. What we can offer for those identities is identity management, access management, a database or precisely directory server with high scaling features and identity governance if you need to have those governance requirements for your employees fulfilled, for instance. Short introduction into the product essentials classes. We have got four classes all together, one about the access management, one about the identity management, the directory service and the identity gateway. Let me give you a short introduction into the content of the four classes and we start with the access management product essentials class here. Course topics deal with access management in general, our vision of access management. Before we go into intelligent authentication, I would also like to call it intelligent authorization, highly flexible authorization. Describe how to protect REST APIs and integrate mobile applications and demonstrate how to improve security with a zero trust approach. Zero trust approach doesn't mean that we never trust the user. It means we never trust that the user is still the only one who is using a particular session, for instance, or whether a session was hijacked already. So in other words, we never fully trust the network. And finally, describe how to integrate with third party SAML two entities. Good old SAML, still a hot topic in identity authentication management, for instance, for federating different accounts of different entities. Identity management, a bit about the topics, Again, we would like to give you an introduction, general introduction about identity management and how we see it at Fortrock. User self-service, very important topic these days, especially in the consumer part, because consumers often want to or have to self-register. We wanna make it as easy and frictionless for the consumers as possible. Describe identity provisioning and synchronization of data. Provisioning and synchronization, of course, is still the core functionality of identity management, so we have to talk about that. And then the business process workflows, which we can implement. Again, here we are focusing more on the workforce, probably. You use business processes to apply for new accesses, for instance, and that actually leads us to identity governance. The identity governance engine makes heavy use of our workflow engine because this is about applying for new accesses or of course also validate the accesses an employee may have. Directory services, our highly scalable directory server. We first start with an introduction again. We have to talk about the directory proxy. Proxying a directory server on the LDAP protocol is not as straightforward as HTTP. So therefore we have an extra brother product to the directory server called the directory proxy. Then we go to explain how to use directory service in an AM or in an IDM deployment. Of course, we at Fortrack like to make heavy use of our own directory server for different functionalities. May it be to maintain our user's profile as well as the session failover for the access manager called the CTS. And finally, we have got the gateway product essentials class, which is obviously about the identity gateway of Fortrack introduction, then we like to give you an introduction into Identity Gateways Studio, which is the UI for administrators and developers to develop new functionality in IG Studio. Describe how to protect a web application with IG authentication. So when we talked about authentication on the authentication server side in the access manager topic, then we actually change this side here and we show you how to protect an application with IG and make it that it requires the appropriate authentication or of course in the next chapter then also authorization. So same topic, but on the other, we're looking at the other side. Describe how to protect REST APIs. Again, we had that already in the AM class. Now we look at it on the other side, who can we, how can we make use of the REST interface of the access manager, but also how can we protect REST interfaces. 
Now, REST interfaces are also often used by microservices in the communication with each other. So we also have an extra path through microservices and how IG has been optimized to protect microservices. Finally, I'd like to give you a little overview of where you could go when you need to know more about Fortruck through Fortruck University. The slide here shows on the horizontal lines the different products and on the column part the essentials class which we just talked about here. Then the next one would be core concepts where you learn a little bit more about the products in quite a bit more time. So those classes are four to five day classes with hands-on experience. If you're a developer and your job is to extend the Access Manager, then you're probably interested in the develop class about the Access Manager. If you're more on the business side and you need to know how governance is implemented in the or through the Identity Manager, we have got a workshop for you. If you more on the deployer side, you have to deploy all our software into a Kubernetes environment, independent whether it's in a Kubernetes environment on a external cloud like the Google Cloud, or you do it on-premises. You will learn about that in the FR5 to 3 deployment workshop. This is four times the same workshop, by the way, because it applies to all the products. And finally, if you have to show the world how good you are, how much you have learned about Fortruck, you can apply for certification. There is the Fortruck Certified Access Management Specialist exam and the Fortruck Certified Identity Management Specialist exam. I can only recommend go through those, do the exam and show the world how competent you are with Fortruck products. I see you there.